Now we're going to begin our brioche bands. And uh, so we're gonna demonstrate row one, right side B. And I want you to notice how there's a, a buddy stitch, a plane, a buddy stitch, a plane, a buddy stitch, a plane. So as you look at your work, you'll be able to see that you are set and ready. You're gonna have some extra stitches at the beginning because with this being a triangular shawl, you're going to be working your increases um, over here. So there may be some stitches that look different um, with their buddy. So we read our um, we read our pattern again. And so we see that it says knit front and back, slip one yarn over, bark, slip one, repeat to last two stitches, knit two together. There are asterisks. That means that you will knit two together with its yarn over. So let's go ahead and get started. We're working with color B. We're going to knit front and back. Okay, now we're going to slip one yarn over. Now there's one thing I wanna show you here. This is a matching stitch. So um, that's because of the building the shawl. So there will be sometimes at the beginning of your uh, row, there might be a barked, uh, a matching stitch that has a buddy. And so that blue is going to be matching. And now we're ready for a bark and a slip and a bark and a slip. Okay, we're coming down. This one is to the last two stitches. So this is still a slip one with a yarn over. And here's my last two stitches. And we treat those as one stitch. So you knit two together with its buddy. Okay, so this is not a turn. This is a slide. 